Hi, Julian. Hi, Brian. Um, first questions for, for Julian. Um, you talked about training. Um, you were supposed to have a fight in November. Um, do you feel that even though you didn't have that fight, the anticipation for it and the work that you put in has kept you primed and ready for this moment? Absolutely. Because I went through a whole a whole four-week camp. I never really stopped training. And then when, when, I, when I got to Vegas in December, in November, I'm sorry, I was already in shape. And uh, I basically went through like a half a camp. My weight was really good. I was probably about 12 pounds overweight once my fight got canceled. So um, it was almost like a almost like a full camp, but it just kept me, you know, something that kept me motivated, kept my mouth water. I know that sometimes when fighters uh, go in and out of, of training camps and they have extended periods of time, they can feel overtrained. Is there any fear that, that you're overtrained at this point? No, not, not, not at all. Not at all. Um, I've been, I've been pro for 10 years. I know when to kind of like, you know, turn it down and pick it up and, you know, keep my weight in check and not make sure I don't peak too soon. And I, I, I pretty much know what I'm doing. Uh, question for Brian, if Brian's on there. Yeah. Uh, Brian, I know that looking at your record, you know, it's a, it's a strong record. There's one blemish on there, which came in 2019 against Larry Gomez, but it was a split decision. Looking back at that fight, is that something that, you know, you felt that you won? Um, and, and, and do you feel like that, you know, that blemish really shouldn't exist? Um, yeah, but you know, it's, it's not about looking back and, crying about you know what happened in the past um there's you know there's always a million excuses behind the scenes but it is what it is and we i learned from it you know you guys saw the like the the change in performances even from that fight to finally you know being more comfortable and everything at 154 in the next one and i feel like you know this fight's uh even more again so it's the type of fight that'll pull out even more for me and you guys will see another big jump in in skill wise and everything thank you gentlemen and best of luck thank you, thank you.